This village is very pretty Thai building next to the canal. So life which is next to the canal is always charming. I come to show you my country and our culture in Bangkok. How are you? It's me, Taya Sujira. If you want to know about Thailand much better, please make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you will not miss anything about my country. Today, I come to such a very cute village in just the area of Bangkok, but I don't think many of you guys who've been here before knowing about this place because I have to confess to you, I never been here before. <laughs> Well, this village is called Huatake, Huatake, and uh, it's just like, uh, what to say, it's the market, and also it's like pretty Thai wooden house that it just reminds us of the old day of Thailand. Luckily that I have chance to come here because right now, this village they are having a faro, that's it called faro? is a faro exhibition so they decorated flower in this beautiful antique wooden village so it's going to be awesome seeing this place so please follow me in the back of me is a canal it's called Krong Buridom or Buridom Canal you can have a look that uh, people still use both as uh, a transport for them but uh, oh, okay. not everybody used it this canal, or you can have a look like so many green plants. This kind of plant is called water hyacinth, and uh, it has to be like a boat machine to just go through this one. Water hyacinth, it just like spreads so fast, but uh, it doesn't seem like people feel uncomfortable because I think they get used to it. This canal. You know, um, if you just keep going direction over there, it can reach to the sea. Back of me is probably like a highlight of this restaurant because the decoration on the wall is just like remind us when we were young at least myself when I was young because I got a chance to use these kind of things this one is just like a plate and I, this is what we use for like a tray as well like we use this for eating 
yeah and uh, it's made of a uh, zinc and uh, so today life's changed we don't use these kind of things anymore so once when we come here we feel like oh we miss our old day when we were young so this is a charm of the, this restaurant and we love it look at the camera look at the camera this one names makam and makam means Tamarind. Well, you can have a look in the background of me somewhere around here. It's just like so pretty wooden house, and uh, just because of the brown color, it really feel like this is real old Bangkok, and we love it. Okay, you may wonder like uh, something like a line in the middle of the the bridge over there. This one is like a very good wisdom for a local around here because uh, when we just walk, we never realize like what it's for. But usually it's for a bicycle to across this bridge. So this is very interesting. You probably wonder like what kind of wooden things like this? They just make it pretty, but it's just like to protect. Nobody can just across to their personal area. And uh, the pretty things about this village is like the door and then they can just walk to their house, their own house. In the back of me is so pretty crocodile. <laughs> the reason that they have a crocodile painting here is just because in this market, it's called Hua Take. Hua it means head. Take is from Jalake, which is means a crocodile. But uh, they say that when firstly the uh, government officer when they first came here, they found the head of crocodile just in this water, in this river. So that's why they call this area Huatake area. So that's why you can see a crocodile painting here. Well, my friend have another legend, so you can tell. Hi, I'm Susan. I've been told by the local people here that the name of this market came from a very interesting legend. Very long time ago, it was a big, big size of crocodile, like a grandfather crocodile. He always came up, right up front of the temple, waiting for someone who dare enough to clean up his skin for him. And local people enjoy to do that for him, I mean to bath him, to clean him on that great Buddhist holy day. But uh, the one who told me the story said that the crocodile already passed away because the story is more like legend long, long time ago. That's so pretty flowers in the bank of me and uh, a lot of coffee restaurants that they decorated with uh, flowers and uh, people love to take a photo around here.
Okay, yeah, you should see this. Just a dollar, I can get something. Beautiful. Oh. <laughs> should I wear this? One dollar. She just make it. Tat eng le lakha. Oh, she made it herself and she sell. <laughs> Guys, should I wear this? Bob Marley. <laughs> I love him. I think this house, they have a lot of television. That's why this television corner everywhere. <laughs> Ah. Yeah, so this village is very pretty and quiet. Probably today is Monday as well. Look at the boat. They just dock the boat around here. Oh, look at the dock. Oh, how cute. color this area has beautiful color like this that's nice color blue. blue we can keep walking and see something pretty <laughs> selfie <laughs> my friend he selfie around here I really love the the shackle before we used this kind of thing so it's so nice to see this kind of old things still have left in this market so and uh, the gentleman in the back is the one who's cooking so he's steaming like a chinese um like a chinese sticker rice it's called bata bata What do you think about this video? I hope you enjoy it, especially myself. I'm very impressed coming here and uh, I'm sure I'm going to come back here again because it's very pretty. But uh, even though today is Monday, but it's quite, pre uh, it's quite busy just because of the, a lot of tourists are excited to come and uh, enjoy themselves, especially the photography is every corner for us to take a photo. So we love it so much and uh, I really hope that you also love it too. So if you think this video is useful and you like it, please don't forget to give me a thumb up so I know that what I'm doing is right things and you enjoy it. And if you appreciate it with my work today and you feel like you want to give me a coffee, you may want it to see a uh, detail below here how to buy me a coffee as uh, saying thanks and support my video and uh, if you want to share this video to your friends you are more than welcome and if you have any questions you want to see anything you want to know anything about my country you can feel free to just write down a comment and share your opinion here and uh, if you haven't subscribed yet please do subscribe and thank you so much for watching until the end. See you next time. สวัสดีค่ะ